Yo, 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 what's good? This is John for Recognize, not one but two Z's, and right here I have... Lulu. What's up, Lulu? What's up? How you been? Good, how are you? How was high school? It's nice. You know, freshman year, it, it passed by quick. Wow. Wow, I remember I was a freshman. i never forget, man. When I was going to Adams, man, that was the worst freshman year ever. I mean, you got my milk taken, my shoes, <laughs> <laughs> everything. So, uh, tell us a little bit more about yourself, how you got started doing music? Well, like, it started way back when I was maybe four. You know, my granddad, he bought my first piano. I was actually, I went to the store, I started playing the piano. I liked the sound, I was like, hey, granddad, can you buy me this piano? He was like, I got you. And so he bought me the piano, and then I just started teaching myself how to play. I never had one lesson either. Mm. And to this day, I just, you know, I just, I do it. And then, when I was about five, my great-grandma bought my first acoustic guitar, mm -hmm. and I started playing it, you know, making some beats, <laughs> and it's just, it's progressed over the years, but it started way back when I was four. Oh. You know, over the years, I just built it upon that and made it to my craft today. Oh, okay. Do you have any other talents besides music? Um, soccer, I'm on the varsity team, which is big, you know, for a freshman. Yeah. I already got my varsity letter and everything. Wow. And basketball. I'm on JV, but it's I'm not that big into basketball, but mm -hmm. I still do it. I do a little bit of graphic design, drawing. Oh. Um, the, um, like playing like uh, plays, like mm -hmm. in the play. I forgot the word. Oh, oh, that's no, yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. That too. So you act. Yes, acting. That's right. the word, acting. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool, because I'm coming out, coming out with my own series, mm -hmm. and I'm looking for a young actor. So, you know, if you're interested, you know, you mm -hmm. can play, you know, probably your mom, too. You know, play, you know that'd be cool. Um, <laughs> excuse me, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, um, so, um, so tell us a little bit more about your single. About my single? Yeah. Um, which one? I have three. Um, me, you, and Hennessy, Blast. Me, you, and Hennessy. Me, you, and Hennessy. Yeah, let me hear that. All yeah, right, let me so, hear that. Yeah. <laughs> um, shout out to Nazi right now. You know, he's the one that put me on the track. And basically, we just wanted to make a remix to that song because a lot of young folks, they're really into Beige Buff, and I like her a lot, you know. I like her music. I know she started from the bottom, which is inspirational, too, because a lot of artists start from the bottom today. But basically, that song is about... You know, just kind of like love. You know, I know it's kind of a sexual song, so I wanted to work around that mm -hmm. to not make it really sexual. You know, at my age. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, it's just kind of like a love song. Okay, yeah, because you guys made it a little bit PG thirteen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right, that's dope, man. So explain the um, you and Nazi um, uh, friendship. Me and Nazi, um, He's like a brother to me right now, you know, I've known him for maybe, maybe two years, mm -hmm. and our relationship just grown upon that, you know. Is we gonna blow up, you know? Yeah, y'all is, I, I see it. I yeah. see it, I see the future, man. So I was looking at Nazi, man, he is hungry. Yeah. Both of y'all is. I was yeah. looking at y'all, like, y'all y'all gonna be something. Mm -hmm. And, you know, and that's real good to have two young, young black kids doing it, you know what I'm saying? Actually come together as one. And and blow up together. That's mm -hmm. that's real major to me. Yeah. Uh, so tell us a little bit more about your project. About my project. Mm -hmm. This summer and maybe June, I should be going to the studio to work on actually original songs. Mm -hmm. And I'm looking to come out with an actual album, not like a mixtape or an EP, okay. like an actual album. You know, get a producer. And I'm looking to go down to a lot of room recordings. It's in downtown Cleveland, but um, yeah, I'm looking for. Oh, okay, okay. You know when you're in the studio now. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, do um, you have any uh, features on there? Features? I have some friends that want to be on there. Okay. Um, other than that, it's just all original. Oh, okay. Well, you know, when you say friends, do you mean like artists or just yeah, personal? Friends, like personal friends, you know. Uh, right. Is that serious? That's my thing. Yeah, you see what I mean. Yeah. You know, that could be a you know, a little downfall because right. you know, this business. This is what you yeah. really actually want to do in life, you know. Because yeah. I had a couple friends who wanna, you know, mm -hmm. they say they wanna do this, so but when, when it's time it. when the time being, um they they don't wanna do it. You right. know they what I'm saying? They start slacking. Right. Yeah. Right, alright, cool. Um to um who who inspired you to become a rapper? Um, 
a rapper, um, J. Cole definitely, because when I listen to his music, he talks about down to earth things, you know, like the struggle, the base of all of that, and this just really inspires me because I know a lot of people are going through the struggle today, mm -hmm. and to be able to listen to that, you know, mm -hmm. like one on one, it's, it really inspires you, you know? Right. Right. And one thing I actually could say about you coming in here, you, I never saw no man very dressed like that. <laughs> like all jokes aside, they dressed with swag and you know. Thank wow, you. man, your mom did a very terrific job. I mean, like seriously. Like, cause I never saw, you know, you real presentable, you know, don't smell like weed, you right. know. <laughs> Thank God, you know. <laughs> That's cool. So, um, what hurdles you had to face to um for this um, project to exist? Definitely doing what I want to do. Like, um, cause you know, some people, they doubt you. Mm -hmm. And that's what you really got to look out for, the doubters and the, and the haters and the, all those people that don't want to see you do well. Because it's sad, but when you're doing your thing, people don't want to see you do well. And so you just got to kind of put your foot down and right. say, you know, I'm going to do this. And if you like it, that's good. If you don't like it, I'm gonna still do what I'm gonna do. So you just gotta keep striving. You know? mm -hmm. All right. She's young doing this too, y'all, man. How old are you again? Four, I mean, 15. 15? Oh, I'm man. I'm gonna say 14. 15. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so who you wanna work, at, work with in the future? Definitely J. Cole. Like I said before, I love him. His music is amazing. J. Cole, Logic. Mm -hmm. He started from the bottom too. Um, uh, what do you think? Drake. Mm -hmm. I like his, his beats. Um, and surprisingly, maybe even Chief Keith. You know, I like, I love his music. Chief, Chief Keith? Chief Keith. Really? Yeah. You don't think Chief Keith? Out of all, yeah. out of all like, artists, Chief Keith. I like his music. Like, his words, you know, sometimes I don't really know what he's saying. Exactly. Yeah. And I look at the type of artist you is? Yeah. No. You can't mix J. Cole with no Chief Key. That is true. But, but it's all good. It's all, all about what you want. Yeah. But, you know, because I listen to your lyrics, it's just like, it hit home. You know? Yeah, but definitely J. Cole, Logic, and Drake. Mm. Definitely that. Oh, and Party Next Door. Yeah, he, he's a good one. Yeah. He's a good one. Um, So, what year you be graduating? 18. 18. Wow, man, I feel so old, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. So, um, you you in the acting. Oh, yeah. Have you ever did any skits? Oh, yeah. When I was in fifth grade, I joined the drama club. Mm. Mm -hmm. I had like three parts. I had to memorize all of them. Wow. And I did. I was the main, one of the main characters, too. Wow. Yeah. Wow. So, um, you don't dance in that. You don't do none of that. Oh. You don't want to see me dance. <laughs> I, you know, Nazi, he a dancer. Oh, know. yeah, yeah. He can dance, but <laughs> when it comes to dancing for me, nah, this place is usually, I can't dance. <laughs> Just two steps. Right. I can do, yeah, two steps. You know, I can do that, but nah, I can't. So, so where you get your style from? It's just me. I just... When they're together? Yeah. Oh, wow. You real mature for your age. Thank you. So when I, when I was your age, I was still rocking blazers <laughs> with the jerseys. Well, that's back in that day. We ain't going to talk about my age. I don't want to. <laughs> so, um, what what type of artist you, you label yourself? Lyrical? Um, trap? <laughs> probably lyrical. Because I like to really get deep into people's mind mm -hmm. and be able to relate to them. Anything from struggles to getting money, all of that. Any of that. I really like to relate to people. Mm. Okay. Because when you can relate to people, that's when people can relate to you. And that's how you get that family. Right. Right. You gotta be strong. Yeah. You know why? Because you play soccer. That's right. Oh, I'm the goalie too. Oh, you the goalie? Yeah, I've been kicked in the face a couple times. Oh yeah! Wow. Yeah. Wow, you real strong. So you have any shout outs? I want to give a shout out to God, number one. Amen. He's the main reason why I'm here today. Mm -hmm. um, my mom, she's stuck with me this whole time. <laughs> my dad, all of my close friends, you know who you are. Um, <laughs> I want to give a shout out to you for having me. Oh, yeah, for sure, man. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks for coming on the show, man. I heard some music. I'm like, yeah, I got to get her. She, <laughs> she, she the future. I know. Yeah. I know real music when I hear it. Okay. Right. Um, I want to give a shout out to my flex movement. It's my own personal movement I've created to basically. Flexing all the people that doubted me, you know, mm -hmm. you know, 
personally, it's hard to deal with that sometimes, you know, but flex movement is a movement where you just flex on people mm -hmm. that doubt you towards, you know, either style or personally, or to give like the wrong perception of you. Right. And so, shout out to my flex movement. Hashtag Team Nazi. Mm. And thank you for having me. Oh yeah, for sure. It's your girl Lulu, you tune in to recognize not one, but two Z's. Hashtag Flex Movement. Let's go.